Okay, this is Miss Briggs. I'm gonna show you how to do an acrylic transfer. So you're gonna take your canvas, make sure you write your name nice and big on the back. Okay. Now you have your printed photograph. You notice that I have some white space on the top and the bottom, that's okay, but make sure you get rid of the white on the edges so that it fits nicely on your canvas. You're going to take an acrylic transfer paintbrush. These are crappy paintbrushes, but we wanna make sure we wash them really well so that the bristles still move. If you forget to wash your brush, it'll turn into plastic and that's not good. So right after we apply the glue, we need to wash our brush. Here is the acrylic transfer bucket. You can see it says gloss gel on it. This is what we're gonna use and we're gonna cover the whole canvas. So I'm gonna grab a big old glob of it. <laughs> and I'm gonna cover my entire canvas nice and thick. You don't want it to be thin. Cover it all up. Um, I like to refer to this as like sour cream because it's like a little thicker. You want to cover the whole canvas, all the corners, nice and thick. I might have gotten just a little bit too much. I'm going to wipe off my extra back in the bucket. No need to waste it. And the way I can tell if it's thick enough is if there's some like texture to it. You don't want to be able to see the surface of the canvas underneath it. So you cover it really thick like that. Any extra, like I said, wipe it off into the bucket. And at this point, it's really important that you go rinse off your brush. Do that before anything else. For the sake of the video, I'm not gonna do that. Now, at this point, you're gonna take your picture, put it face down on your canvas, like so. And you kind of gently press, I'm not pressing very hard, but gently press so that your paper and the glue kind of merge together and I just go and get rid of any bubbles. There's, if there's a little bit of bubbles, that's okay. You do not wanna get any of the plastic on the back side of your paper, so make sure your hands are really clean. There's no acrylic transfer, because if you get this glue on the back side, then it won't work. So make sure you don't get any of that acrylic transfer on there. At this point, what I usually do is I go grab paper towels and I clean off the edges. I forgot to grab that, but I'm gonna go grab some right now. I'm gonna take my brush over to So I'm gonna grab some paper towels and I'm gonna clean up those edges. Like I said, make sure you don't get the glue on your paper. If you need to use multiple paper towels, that's fine. I kind of angle it. You do not want to get this stuff on you because it'll turn your clothes into plastic essentially. Okay, so that's how you do the transfer. Now you're going to leave this to dry for 24 hours, just like that.